Before we actually start, I'd like to wish a very happy birthday to my friend Duddles, as yesterday was his 18th birthday. Happy birthday to you, Duddles. I hope it is a very spectacular, wonderful birthday, and you get everything that your sexy little heart desires on your special of specialist days. Without further ado, let us begin with the episode. Okay, pause guys and gals, welcome back to Let's Play Batman Arkham City Part 15. Last time we left off, we go into a battle with the Joker and... Well, you go strange, activate protocol 10 and everything's going to shit. So now we have to scan each of these planes here, get the codes in order to get into the Wonder Tower. Alright, no, it one doesn't have it. And the thing is here is that each of these helicopters has a Gatling gun equipped to it, so we do have to be... Somewhat careful when scamming them. We're approaching them at least. No, I can't do that now. I was going to see if we could approach a Titan container, but it's probably out of the way still. So. Gotta focus on this tool because, you know, people are dying and it's our responsibility as Batman to save the people of Gotham, even though they are inmates. I mean, then again, you know, there are some people here who on, are on, you know, don't belong here, of course. I swear to God, if I have to go through, like, every single one of these. In no way, though, I think, at least, that Protocol 10, it doesn't affect anything, like, in terms of, like, the actual story progression, like, quests and stuff that we can do, so... Hopefully we can still access them after the fact. Yeah! Gotta pull up my PSP, yeah. I've got the code. I'm heading to Wonder Tower. Good. Really? You're doing the right thing. The code should let you enter via the guard room near the main gate. Don't lose Talia's signal. When I'm finished in the tower, I'm going after her. She doesn't know Joker. She's out of her depth. I need to save her. Right. We are off to Wonder Tower. Hmm. Do I want to head the right away, though? I mean, yes, everything's kind of being destroyed and blown up around me, but... Ah, uh, you know what? I think I'm going to deal with the Bane stuff first. Really quick to see if I can. I don't think I can, exactly. I think I might have effed myself in that department. Eh! I made stuff overly complicated at this point. Given all the helicopters that are now around. I don't think us doing this will have any type of impact, like, on the actual game itself. Hopefully. But... No. Are you surprised to see me, Batman? No. A little. Last time I saw you, you were wrapped around the hood of my car. You knew it would not kill me. I wasn't trying to. I'm in no mood for a fight. What are you doing here? Dr. Young's Titan formula. The Payaso managed to send some off Arkham Island before you stopped him. I know. Penguin had his own Titan guards. How much more did Joker send out? Too much. That is why I am here. I will not allow the Basura of this city to abuse the Titan. Dr. Young used me to create it. It is my duty to destroy what remains. I'll help you, but understand this. If you try anything, I'm taking you down, too. We find Titan containers, we destroy them. Deal? <laughs> of course. Each container has a radio beacon built in. There were 12 containers left in this city. We take six each, then we meet back here. I'm ahead of you, Bane. You find your six. I'll take care of what's left. You've got some catching up to do. And remember, I'm trusting you. Don't make me regret that. Okay. And there's only... Two left. Three left, actually. I just want to get these two before we head over to the steel mill. Just so as soon as... We finish everything up, not the steel mill, uh, as soon as we finish everything up in the Wonder Tower or whatever, we can, you know, get the XP that we deserve and hopefully get through this easily. 
And they pretty much just loop this, like all the dialogue and stuff. I mean, yes, people die, but there's a specific set amount that are going to die. I'm assuming at least. I actually have never put this task off for so long. Never put the task off going to one tower, you usually just go there like straight ahead. But like I said, I like to get a little extra something before going forward. I don't even think there's gonna be like any uh like guard or anything like patrolling the area. Come to think of it. Not guards, but like um, you know, inmates and stuff like getting in our way. I think they've all sort of Well, they're all either dead. You know, because of the bombing, or, uh, you know, in hiding somewhere? Perhaps in a dumpster. If I was in a situation like this, I'm not really sure what I would do. Like, as an inmate, not as Batman, but as, like, a, you know, in Arkham City, having shit being bombed down, I'd, hmm. Uh, maybe... I don't know. Will be a good place to hide in a situation like this. Definitely not one of the boats, because, you know, they stand out a bit too much. Okay. Maybe... I was considering Mr. Freeze's thing, but... Eh... I don't think he likes to say, uh... Oh! 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 Oh. Oh no. Ooh. Let's hurry this up. Maybe... Uh, hmm. I don't know, maybe not in the building, because, you know, that, if they fall, then... Yeah, I'm fucked. Maybe the subway system. That's probably not a good idea, because eventually it'll collapse, but... Eh. Might last me a little while. Eh. Boom, alright, now we only have one left. Goody. Should I do one? Nah, let's just get on with the, uh... Finale, the Wonder Tower. Perhaps I'll do the Alice in Wonderland quest after we finish up the Wonder Tower. Just because it's a pretty good quest, I feel at least. Ooh. Oh, come on. Zero visual on target. I repeat, we have lost sight. Visual on target. I repeat, we have visual on Batman. That, that. We have zero visual on Batman. Oh, my God. I'm just gonna chill right here for a little bit. Just in case. Alright. Down here, pull out my... Oh my goodness! Go away! Oh means no, you stupid player. How close can you get, Jesus Christ? These are all like remotely activated or operated or something. Leave me alone. Shoo! Oh. Dark. I repeat, we have no eyes on Batman. Good boy. Fuck off. Asshole. Alright, let's do this quick. Mastermind. Such a egotistical great password. Good work, Strange. I'm showing multiple hits in sector two. Bam. Uh, ooh. Gotta pull up my Rick. There we are. And I suppose I have to go down here. I don't have the amplifier equipped, so Oop. Didn't mean to do that. And nothing's down there. We all clear. All right. Please don't do it again. We escape your inmates. Those tiger guards have stun sticks. I need to attack from behind to avoid. Oh God. Hold them in process. 
I hate these goddamn sticks. Fucking electronic sticks. Oh my god. And you're down for the count. And you're down for the count. Awesome. It's another pace breaker. We need to talk. And I know right. you wouldn't be able to live with yourself if your actions caused this poor man to die. I have a question for you. Before my arrival, this city was drowning under a tide of filth. Have you ever considered that all this is your fault? Your presence creates these animals. Like germs, they spread. You created the environment that allowed the germ to mutate, to become stronger. Look at the Joker. Would he even exist if not for you? It must be depressing. All your sacrifices, and yet, you are the one to blame. Oh, this is beautiful. We have at long last defeated the great Batman. Soon, I will take my rightful place at my master's side. We will rule over this world. So thank you, Batman. For all your help. Now, kill him! Shoot. Oh, oh, no, bad boy. Oh, you piece of... Interesting. I feel as though we did talk about this earlier on. Uh, if Batman's presence simply does promote, you know, villains in general and stuff. They're just super villains, period. Um, which, in some part, I suppose could be, you know, it's... Like... The need for Batman in this world is that he doesn't have jurisdiction, henceforth why he can't necessarily be corrupted. Unlike the police and stuff in the police department. But as a result of that, you know, his actions do cause... You know, supervillains to be produced. People with abilities, um, you know, unlike that of like a typical criminal and stuff. And the question is, like, would get Gotham truly be better? Um, if Batman had no involvement in it whatsoever. Oh, Jesus Christ. I knew I was better than you. Beast, I have hair! Now you have proved it. Beautiful. Scrumptious hair. Like you, you bald bastard. And I think to a point that, um, you know, maybe there will one... I know that the Nolan films kind of talked about this and stuff, but... Uh... With the whole superhero, like, the supervillain stuff, like, really... And the same could be said, like, for, like, Superman, or, um, you know, pretty much any hero in general. Like, if they're just simply by existing, are they promoting this supervillain stuff? To have some type of, uh, supreme-powered individual that matches them in some type of value, or exceeds them, or attempts to exceed them. I mean, just look at Edward Nigma. He's obsessed with the Batman, and proving the Batman wrong. Hence for his reasoning of doing all these crimes. At least in this universe. I know in, um... Gotham it's a bit different. But then, and then you have stuff like the Penguin, who... Did, who existed long before Batman and stuff, and will most likely continue to exist, like, after Batman. So... The question is, could Gotham survive if, say, Batman were to... Just stop in general, like, after pretty much dealing with all the supervillains, and finding a way to ensure that these supervillains will never come back. And the question is, how would you? I mean, yes, you have things like Arkham Asylum, but obviously those places have become corrupt. And I think really the only way that, you know, say Batman could, um, defeat these supervillains is if... 
at some point this rise in supervillains stopped and he was just, you know, outlasting them, combat combating them at every turn, like through the ages and stuff. Pretty much devoting his entire life to being, you know, Batman. Which, yeah, it sucks, but really that is necessarily my way, because I feel that, you know, these villains aren't going to stop even without Batman. Like with the Penguin especially. Maybe the Joker, because, you know, he sort of only lives for the sake of uh, bringing turmoil to Batman, it seems. I mean, yes, you know, he's all about chaos and stuff, especially with, like, Gotham, but it seems that a mighty contributor to that would be the Joker, you know. And without him, or without Batman, you know, Joker sort of loses purpose. I know that some comics have really, you know, touched on this a lot. So, there was one in particular where Batman actually... The Joker thought that Batman has actually killed as a result of one of his tactics or whatever. So he just returned to a normal life and became like a, I think it was like a publisher? Or was it like a graphic designer? I don't, I don't, I don't quite recall. It's been a while since I read that one. Oop! And you're out of the count. And I've had enough of your shit too, my boy. Good night. All them shades. Oh! Oh, that pose! Look at that pose! Pointless effort, Dark Knight. You cannot stop the inevitable. Rain down fire and brimstone on these animals. Sorry. I know we shouldn't have, but it's chaos in there. Strange is killing everyone he sent in here. He calls it Protocol 10. What do you want us to do? Wait here. I'm going after Strange. Alright. Oop, didn't want to do that. Actually, yeah, this is the area we originally started out at. I wonder if I could see what's over there really quick. If I can just pull up my line launcher. There we are. And... Get on! Anything in here? Oh, just another really trophy. Yeah, this is where we started at the very beginning of the game. Is well, what's his face still in here? No, they moved him. Oh, that's locked. Alright. Oh, memories. It was just about ten hours ago that I crashed my skull against that television. What about here? Anything in here? A phone. Ooh. Or enough messing around, I suppose. Time to open the gates. Come on. There we are. Alright. Is there anything else I can do here by chance? No, I don't think so. Where is this supposed to go? That's okay. That's okay. Oh, oh yeah. Alright, that's interesting. Oh, man. Oh, you're here. Oh, what? Oh, he's supposed to be here. Can't do that. Oh, he's supposed to be here. Oh, he's supposed to be here. Uh. Let's see, I've been in there. Are you serious? Do I have to really come down? Ah. It takes a special person to miss this stuff. We're back in the sewers now. Alright. Oop. Okay. It should be a pretty linear route from here, I believe. Unless I'm missing something. No. 
Alright. Anything at all? No, not at all. Hmm. Nope. God damn it. Oh, wait, there's a ladder there. That's not a ladder. Huh. No, I just want to glide freely, damn it. Son of a goddamn biscuit. Alright, let's just do that. Do that. And we're supposed to go that way. Ooh, a little tricky traversing this area. Oh, didn't want that. Kaboom! Hmm. All right, there it is. That's where you have to go. Oh, hello, nurse. It's you. I told you I'd be back. Well, you took your time. It's crazy back there. First Joker's men came down here and started setting up camp. I did what you said and hid, but... What happened? There were guards. You know, the ones that work for Strange. They came down and started killing everyone. It was a bloodbath. It sounds like Strange is trying to cover his tracks. You seem to be good at hiding, Doctor. Stay here and do it again. I'll deal with the guards in that room. How did they not see you up here? Professional guards, my ass. Oh, there's the last thing to tell you. Or Titan. Yeah. I really should have gotten that before. I am so sorry. Wow, that was... Man, okay. Stupid moment on my part there. As we move into the final stage of Protocol 10, I would like to congratulate all Tiger Forces on this wonderful achievement. As I look at the screens in front of me, I can see that we are rapidly approaching fatalities of 22%. My projections show that within three hours, every single inmate oh, son of a will be dead, and Protocol 10 will move into Stage 2. By the end of the month, new camps in Keystone and Metropolis will open, each modeled after Arkham City. You should all be proud of your part in this. We are the solution this world needs. We are the future. Bye, that's a pile of bodies. You, Mr. Nosy Bastard, should have kept your fucking eyes where they can see me do my business. So surprised, come here. Not even a little tap on the metal. And let's try not to fuck this up. Check your numbers. Shoot, shoot, shoot. God damn it. Now he's getting a new weapon. Why did you do that? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? So literally only four more people left. Okay, I need to stop doing whatever the hell that is I'm doing. Getting greedy with my duck rings. Can I do it? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. No, I did it. There's only two more left now. Check your numbers. Move 
You come here. Thank fucking goodness. This is unacceptable. I taught you better than this. Oh, Batman, this is not over. It's ending. Sooner or later. That's the last canister. Canister Titan. Now that all the Titan containers are destroyed, I should go back to Bane and see how he's doing. Do I want to go back? Hmm. Alrighty, folks, we've reached our time for today's episode, so see you all next time on part 16 of Let's Play Batman Arkham City. So farewell, Levita saying, happy to say goodbye. Peace.